Good evening. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. I'm Pat Simon. Port Aransas has many fishing guides, but many knew Captain Gary Cooper. The United States Coast Guard is now investigating a boat crash that claimed Cooper's life over the weekend. Iran Hammy spoke to an eyewitness of that crash and tells us how Cooper will be remembered. Everybody knew of Gary Cooper. You know, they called him Coop. Everybody knew of Coop. Just before 6.30 Saturday morning, Captain Gary Cooper was taking clients out for a fishing excursion. James Joseph was on his boat with three others closely behind Cooper. He was showing them a good spot to start their fishing day. According to Joseph, a third boat coming from Aransas Pass approached at a fast pace. Joseph says his son looked up and yelled, he's going to hit him. Hit Captain Cooper's boat uh, directly broadside and launched his boat over the top of Captain Cooper's boat. Uh, and landed approximately 10 to 15 feet on the other side of his boat. It was here in front of Roberts Point Park where the crash happened. Cooper was heading east past the jetty as the other boat came from the west. Joseph says his son then sped up to the crash site to help. They were yelling, man in the water, man in the water. As we got closer, I said, Captain Cooper's in the water. He said, Captain's in the water. As soon as the crash happened, Joseph called 911. After a few minutes of searching, they found Cooper unconscious in the water. He was the only one knocked into the water. We navigated towards him, pulled him into our boat, uh, took four of us to pull him in the boat, immediately started CPR. There was only one person in the other boat. Joseph says there were no obstructions that morning, no rain, no fog, calm waters, light wind. Joseph knew Cooper for almost 20 years. He says Cooper is the reason his son became a boat captain. The three of them shared many memories, but Joseph says what will be remembered most is how well-respected Cooper was in Port Aransas. Just a very nice human being, and, and I think that's, you know, of course he's going to be missed as, as a boat captain, but he, even more so in my opinion, just as a, as a gentleman and, and a mentor to so many people. The United States Coast Guard is investigating the crash, but no charges have come yet. They are being assisted by Texas Parks and Wildlife Department. Reporting in Port Aransas, Ron Hammy, Chris 6 News.